Hello guys and welcome back to a new Spring Boot episode. Today we are going to see how to create a custom banner for your Spring Boot apps. A custom banner looks something like this. So if you want to personalize your Spring Boot application and add in your logo or the name of the app in a more you know, personalized way, this is the perfect video and you'll see how easy it is to change this behavior in Spring Boot applications. I fired up IntelliJ and I've created a standard Spring Boot application with a Spring Initializer. I didn't write any code except the one that comes uh, built in. So we're not interested in the functionalities, we're interested in seeing how we can change the default Spring Boot banner with a custom one. And if you fire any Spring Boot application, by default you get this banner over here. And let's see how we can change it you know, to meet our personalization needs. Well, you can open up a browser and search for Spring Boot custom banner generator and you'll get you know, a couple of sites. Um, I'll pick this one because it worked for me. And here you have a couple of options. You can provide a text, so I say awesome app. And then you can provide you know, various fonts uh, just to um, give a cool look and feel to your app. And I'm gonna select the Star Wars font because well, everybody loves Star Wars, especially developers. Uh, Star Wars, Star Wars, okay, so this is my custom banner. You can copy paste it, I'm gonna copy it. And now I'm going to go back to my Spring Boot app and inside main resources, we have to create a new file and the file name must be banner.txt. So this file is searched by Spring Boot when it starts. Click okay and copy paste it over here and save it. Now, if we run our app again, we'll see that uh, our new banner will be applied. Cool, so we have awesome app, our banner is applied. Uh, however, you know, it's, it's kind of white and we all know that the Star Wars theme is, uh, you know, yellow. So what can we do to change that? Well, we can go here on top of it and select something like, I think is, um, Anzi color, one minute. Okay, Anzi color, and I'll select bright yellow. And I'm just going to put this color uh, on top of the banner so that all the text gets colored. I'm also gonna leave a couple of white spaces here just to uh, separate the banner from the logs. I'll restart the application and now uh, we should get a yellow um, banner, which looks, you know, awesome, just like that. Okay, so you can play around with these placeholders, you can color various lines uh, in different colors, and you can really, you know, customize this banner up. So, there you have it, it's extremely, extremely easy to change this, um, this banner in Spring Boot apps. I hope you enjoyed this video. Before we close, I would like to remind you to subscribe to this channel and stay tuned for more software development tutorials that will sharpen your programming skills. Just go to the Romanian Coder YouTube page and click on the subscribe button. Also, if you found this video useful, please hit the like button and share it with your friends. If you have any comments, thoughts or ideas for new courses, just put them in the comment section at the end of this video because I would love to get feedback from you guys. You can also find me on Twitter at Romanian Coder and you can also check out my blog www.romaniancoder.com. Until next time, have a great day and write amazing code. Goodbye.